Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvanian toy collector. And no, this is not a review. I figured I haven't done a collection review in a while, a collection video in a while, not review, collection video. So we're going to be going through my room and showing off all the stuff I have in my collection as of 2022. I do have this uh, Nerf. Zombie Strike crossbow, because it reminds me of Daryl's crossbow from Walking Dead. I just love that piece when I found it at the thrift store. We got the Power Rangers Super Mega Force spear, Orion spear. Yeah, there's a panel loose on the electrical box. That's why you're seeing the electrical box. We got my autographed picture of the kid who played Boba Fett, young Boba Fett, and it's autographed by him. As you know, I have a my first autographed picture up here with my Halo Mega Blocks Covenant. Why not? And I do have a thing for my little pony stuff. And you're probably wondering why do I pick this stuff up? I just think the eyes on these figures are so cute and adorable. That's why I got a little shelf of them. <laughs> All right, they're so cute and adorable. And as you know, I do have a little vintage Disney collection. I got a lot of vintage Disney stuff. I do love some Disney. <laughs> Here we got some more Halo NSC Covenant. Not Covenant, but yeah. Not NSC, but Covenant from Halo. We got some Force Awakens Star Wars right there. And a picture of me and a family member in the Batmobile that Adam West drove. Why not? We got my computer over here, which is nice. I got some of my little stuff I've grabbed from the thrift store in front of it. Some stuff I've grabbed over the years and put by my computer for display purposes. Why not? We got some more stuff up here. This is my Knight's Kingdom's shield. Got a couple Baymaxes mixed in there. Kylo Ren's lightsaber. Huge Iron Man. And a picture of Yusei Funo from Yukio 5Ds. Oh, I love that. We got a Shock Trooper from Star Wars. We got some Marvel plushies. I love some Marvel plushies. Why not? I have quite a bit of Marvel plushies. Got some of my binders up here, too. You got my Mickey Mouse train up there. Something I got off a goldfish package in that I put in a frame. Another one of those. Got some more Disney train stuff. Why not? <laughs> We got my Star Wars up here. We got this huge military tank that reminds me so much of a clone turbo tank that I got a clone trooper driving this thing. And we got R2-D2, Boba Fett, and Rogu also taking a ride on the turbo tank. Why not? Over here, we got my huge soldier force. Huh. I forget what they call these, but I think they're called jumbo jets that are military that carry, like, soldiers and vehicles. I don't know what, what to call them exactly. I'm not very good with that. Over here, we got my entire collection of scary figures as of last year. And I will be adding some more scary figures that I am going to be reviewing starting Sunday here on the channel. Why not? We got some minions because I just thought that Minions movie was so funny. I got a little collection of Minions toys. Why not? Got some more random figures down here. I got a lot of random figures. We got Rugrats. We got S Looney Tunes. We got Snoopy. We got The Last Dragon. We got every seeable figure down here, including some Force Awakens toys. Why not? And here is where I got my big collection of Toy Story Toys. And this is my most huge collection. And I'm always looking for more to add to this classic Toy Story shelf. Probably wondering, why do I have a second big buzz? He's got part of his helmet. If I ever get one with a complete helmet, then those two are just going to be donated to the thrift store. If I get one found one of these days with a complete helmet, It'll look nice on the shelf. And we got Bullseye. He's Woody's horse up here. A couple Bullseyes and Woody's. One's got his hat, one doesn't. I might make it my goal of 
by next year to get Woody's hat so I can have him completed with Jesse and Bullseye. Why not? We got some stuff from Lightyear here too as well. Here we got some more random Lego stuff and some more random little cars things. Why not? Here we got my whole Bakugan collection. And I got quite the collection of Bakugan figures and balls and giant Bakugan. I just love these things so much. That's why I've collected every last one I've ever gotten over these years. Down here, we got my Batman stuff, and we're always looking for more Batman stuff to add to the shelf. You remember that Batman from the Batman jet with Mr. Freeze? Why not? Now we're going to move down a shelf to another Batman shelf. We got an Imagine X Batcave with Batman villains down there in a Batmobile. Why not? We got some more little Batmans, because I love Batman. I am the Knight. I am Batman. And here we got my Gotham City Jail. Why not? And I got a bunch of villains on there already. And a custom javelin. Why not? Over here we got my Justice League shelf. It is not very big yet, but it's coming along nicely. I'm always adding more figures to this shelf. Why not? And this is my random figure shelf. I predict by the end of somewhere in the next three years, this shelf is going to be filled with some awesome action figures. I'll just have to keep collecting until I fill this shelf up. And you're probably wondering, why do I have those Dr. Suits, the Grinches, walkie-talkies? Well, they were cool pieces I found at the thrift store. At the outlet, and if you saw that video where I showed off these, they were pretty awesome. So that's why they're on this shelf. Why not? Here we have my random marble figure shelf. Why not? I got them all in here. And my goal is to get an entire collection of marble figures in this one collection. That's going to be my goal to fill up that shelf one of these days. Up here, we got my Halo Spartan shelf. We got some actual Spartans. My custom Alpha One Spartan. Just a repaint of Master Chief. Why not? And a whole lot of Halo minifigures from Mega Blocks. And these are so cool. I did pick up some more at the Goodwill outlet. So you will be seeing those added to this shelf as well. Up here we got my random plushes. We got Raphael, that ugly doll. We got the Michelin Tire Man, Kermit, Grinch, Snoozer, Grinch. Well, the animated series Grinch. Unicorn that reminds me from one from Harry Potter, Princess Daisy, and the Dragon. Why not? Over here, we got my, my Star Wars figure collection from the vintage Resistance slash Rogue One collection and Old school Star Wars figures. They have their own shelf in here now. Why not? Here is my entire Lego City collection. And here's even more of my Lego City stuff. As you know, I have only three shelves of Lego City. Why not? And this is my Jurassic Park slash Jurassic World collection. And I've got a bunch of different dinosaurs and figures down here. Because I love those movies of Jurassic Park and Jurassic World. Why not? Here we got some more Jurassic Park or Jurassic World stuff here on this shelf. Looking all nice. <laughs> Looks like a sold one of these guys fell over. These Dino Valley guys easily fall over. This is my Mario collection. It's not very big, but it is pretty extensive, if you know what I mean by extensive. And that's most of the collection in here as of 2021. And this is my first collection room before you get to my bedroom. I was glad to finally show this off this year, my entire collection, in one collection room as of 2022. If you like this video, please make sure to like, please make sure to comment, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. 
And I would appreciate it if you would subscribe to this channel. Because I get a lot of awesome figures that I add to my collection each and every year. I look forward to extending my collection shelves a bit, get them a bit more fuller pretty soon. And this is Eddie Hill, moving on and rock on and rock out YouTube land.